Or a six. Is it six, the one that the purple one? Oh. I didn't know there was one with purple stuff. <laughs> All right, looks like they're going right into it. Red Ranger versus Mach. This is a loser semis. Just some neutral -y stuff going on right now. <laughs> Nothing big. Oh, we got a grab. No chain throws in this matchup. Okay. Unlike, unlike many. <laughs> Ganondorf is definitely a thrower. Mox, happy to take his time in this matchup. Just uh, hang back, heal up his B. Okay, so last season I was informed by our new uh, producer. substitute producer. Teal's telling us that Mach is 7-0 against Red Ranger from last season. Ooh. Red Ranger keeping it really even, especially given that statistic we just heard. Yeah. But it's not incredibly surprising, considering Ivy's edge guards should be perfect. Yes, absolutely. Ganondorf. Agree. Okay. I don't think that there's a mix-up in the world to, to save Ganondorf from an angry plant frog with vines. No, but a forward air to the face might help. Uh-oh. Yeah, definitely. You can definitely nip it in the bud, as it were. <laughs> oh, that was a... What? <laughs> the accuracy with which he hit that solar... Oh, ball. my goodness. Pinpoint. This guy is a sharp shooter. Dash attack, dash attack. What was it after the dash attack? Is it up B solar beam? I don't even remember because I was just kind of flabbergasted. Yeah, me too. Uh-oh. Oh, expert dodging that. Get up attack. Okay, Mox just not letting him breathe at this point. Yeah, definitely. Give the man some air. Oh. Red Ranger coming up for air with that tech. And he still hits with the bullet seed. Oh. Oh. Wow. Never in my right mind would I have thought of that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it is crazy the things that the, the extensions of combos that Machiavelli puts together. He's like, you know, the, all of the combo pieces are Legos. And he, we look at the Legos and we go, oh, well, this obviously fits with this. Yeah. We piece things together. Mach just looks at him and he's like, you know, these two have nice color synergy. Like, he sees things that we don't. Yeah, I can see that. Wow. It's Machiavelli is trying to feel himself. And he's, like, failing somehow. <laughs> 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 he's so far in the lead that it doesn't look like it's going to batter. Red Ranger disagreeing, though. Ooh, I didn't know that uh, Bulbasaur could jump out of there. Mm. Yeah, it seems like a lot of these combos are not true. They're no, they're very false. Okay. Oh! Good choice there. Yeah. That was smooth. <laughs> that was smooth. <laughs> that was, that, yeah, that was, that was some Bizarro-esque stuff right there. Ganon on ice. Mm. Oh! Okay. Ivy choosing to whip it. And whip, whip it good. There we go. So, Mr. Red Ranger, like you said before, I totally agree with you that in that Ganon has a hard time recovering against Bulbasaur's multi-vine wall of pain. Right. I wonder if even a stage counter pick can help him out. Because if it, if in the last season he didn't get one set win on Machiavelli, I, mean, I don't know what he's going to do. Right. It seems like it is an incredibly tough matchup with Ivysaur being mobile enough, not really mobile, but really outranging, uh, just really outclassing Ganon's moves in the neutral. I like the weight there with the neutral air, kind of getting the shield stab. <laughs> Seed bomb snipes. Excellent float. That was a root beer float right there. Tasty, delicious, foamy. Ooh, yeah. I can go for one right now, and if because we're at the KO Lounge, I'm sure they'll be able to <laughs> we look us up. We can probably order one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Oh my god, I sound like I'm Body selling Energems set. or Brain <laughs> Juice or whatever the hell that's called. Yeah. <laughs> brain Drain. Sell out, boys. Let's go. Sell out, boys. Wow. That was a fast Meteor Cancel. That was pretty fast, but not fast the, enough. Yeah, the launch speed was crazy. Uh oh I like this choice. Yeah, Founder Dreams, you know, it's the, the smallest blast boxes he had available. And uh, I don't know if the platforms are going to enter into it in, in a big way. Yeah. It's more about the blast zones. 
what I like to look at when I'm ooh, kind of observing these type of matches where there's like a heavy neutral and uh, there's like a lot of spacing elements going on, especially with Ivysaur's Vines. Yes. I like to see how the opponent, specifically in this instance Red Ranger, mm -hmm. how he kind of just drifts back and preemptively tries to catch the next move. Not the move that he's doing now, but the one in the future. Mm. Not yeah. that time. <laughs> a, lot of, a lot of thought going into this neutral when it's done successfully. Yeah. Back air. Meaty, meaty back air. Big, big purple Ganon fist. Coming in hot. Like, I think Smash is like the game that has the most sexual innuendo per minute. <laughs> 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 that no one really acknowledges, but they were just kind of like, oh, whatever. We'll yeah, well, it's there. We're I just, mean, we, we literally get together with large groups of people and Smash. Yeah, that's what we do. That's it's our thing. Solar Beam to the kill. Evens it up. Yeah, Red Ranger did take an, an advantage, though, for the first time in the set. Nice. Short set that it's been so far. Ooh, that platform height seems really important. Red Ranger was able to tech there instead of letting Machiavelli continue that punish. I like to land behind the shield there by Mach, but didn't really capitalize too much. Ooh, that forward tilt was a really good move choice. Uh, covered both sides of him. Uh -oh. Ooh. I'm not liking these down throws too. Oh, up smash! Close range solar beam. Like a shotgun at the face. Yeah. Laser shotgun. What is this, Borderlands? Ooh, Red Ranger mixing it up a ton in neutral. Which is what you gotta do as Ganon. He's got floats, he's got wave lands, he's got aerials. What more but did you want? He wants the lead, but he doesn't have that. <laughs> Fair point. Nice power shield there from Red Ranger. Yeah, deceptively hard to uh, power shield those Razor Leaves. Wow. There we go. Decisive. There it is. Yeah. Oh, speaking of decisive, up smash off the top platform kills at 84. Uh, uh -oh. Red Ranger looks a little despondent there. He's like, no, Wait. I'm struggling. Okay, going back. It's quarters, which I guess means best of here. Semis. Oh, it's semis. Yes. I thought it's a quarters. Mobby. No, nope, you're good. You are good, good sir. Yeah, and, and I definitely think that this is the the best stage available. Uh, heading right back here seems correct for Red Ranger. Oh, look at that punish. I like the placement there on the forward tilt, but it was Mach was able to get the sweet spot. Uh oh, he's gonna get something. I'm glad he went to chase him, but Mach yeah. had an answer. Oh, there are the vines. Coming out. Oh! <laughs> Tasty. Oh. Going for the choke slam in neutral. I think it's a good a good option to mix in occasionally. Yeah. It's something you don't want too much of. Ooh. Kind of a greedy uh, vine whip. Yeah, but it's it's easy to say that, but then how many times have we gone, oh my gosh, that Vine Whip was insane? <laughs> this is very true. I so guess he, it's probably right on the edge. Yeah. I do agree, though. It, I mean, it looked greedy <laughs> to me. Like, I, just, I trust I trust Machiavelli, you but can't, it looked pretty greedy. <laughs> you can't have your greedy. cheesecake and eat it too, dude. <laughs> <laughs> you can't double back on commentary. Sorry, man. It's okay. I'm, it's fun. It's all in good fun. Thanks for tuning in, all y'all in Chatland, Hitbox Chatland. Woo! Oh! Not quite the right read that time. A little bit of a plant explosion. Taking Red Ranger off the top again. And that seems like the fact. Ooh. Big punish. Wow. Red Ranger just went totally insane. Some of those decisions were freaking nutty. Like, I didn't think that Ganon's grab would grab I was in the middle of her grab. Mm. And then. I, I I don't know what to say. Like, he just stuns me sometimes. Yeah, agreed. Ranger does make a lot of really clever decisions in the neutral game. Which is what earns him those those big meaty hits. Boom. Remind me to talk about meaty before uh, before the next set. Okay, meaty. 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 Ah! Oh. 
three hits, 44%. Yep. Oh, that was such long range. From downtown. Yeah, definitely the half court shot there. Oh, no, Red Ranger, please stay on yeah. stage. <gasps> cool. Look at that. Do something risky. Oh, what? This string's insane. Oh, barely missed the dash past him for the grab. <gasps> Great catch there from Red Ranger. Red Ranger reaching a little bit, but getting what he's looking for. Nice. Stuff. Bring it back one game. After the set, we're going to talk about Meaty. Yes, thank you for reminding me. Oh, no problem. No. I, I, <laughs> I wouldn't want to forget an opportunity to talk about Meaty. <laughs> All right, sure thing. <laughs> we're, uh, Red Ranger is trying to think, where does he want to ban? Where do you think he's going to ban? Well, it doesn't matter now because we're going to PS2. <laughs> Fair point. <laughs> PS2. Mach was killing off the top constantly. Um... Definitely looking forward to having that low ceiling and the big blast zones on the sides as well. And what a statement with that uh, bind win. Yeah. Kind of just crazy, out yeah, Randy. crazy anti air call out. Okay. I like the attempt there from Raid Ranger, but didn't get the right one he's looking for. What the hell? Charge forward smash into seed bomb. Oh my gosh. Mach is, he's trying to make a combo video happen. Ooh. He'll just call it Sunday Legacy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, uh, what a taunt. <laughs> <laughs> characters with projectiles just have such a huge advantage on a slow, large character like Ganondorf. Oh, oh, what a call out. What a crazy <laughs> read. He just did Future Sight. Like, that's what it was. <laughs> like, three turns into the future, he's like, I know that you're going to come up and you're going to just hit my foot. <laughs> that was ridiculous. And hearing Ivy's death grunt. Ivy! <laughs> like, oh. That hurts. It hurts me. I'm a big fan of Ivysaur. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I like Ivysaur. Ivysaur is a cool Pokemon. <laughs> I like the. I like him. Her, him, whatever. Yeah. Whatever. This one's call. female, despite the deep voice. I <laughs> like. Oh. Uh oh. Nice. Lethal Don't. punish off that power shield. And storing the solar beam. I thought he was gonna use it at one point, but it's nice to have it for the next stock. Yeah. That's like that's sort of like a quarter stock advantage. You know, it it just it keeps it from getting into that high percent range where you have trouble finishing it. Okay. That looks like it's a very dangerous spot. I'm not oh. an Ivysaur expert, but if you're on a shield on a platform above Ivysaur, it doesn't look like you can do much. Ooh! Red, no! Greedy. I think, well, he would have been in such a terrible position if he got hit by that up there. I think he was just dead. So, interrupting with that forward air. Just the best he could do. Yep. Couldn't quite make it through the stage, though. And the pain train comes in for Ivy. Uh-oh. Oh! He was convinced that Red Ranger was making it on stage. Tried to punish there. <gasps> what an attempt at a, like a semi-spike. And that's it. Good enough. Red Ranger was far enough out that he couldn't make it back. 